Very exciting day today. We are shipping out our first set of snakes. So cue the intro, dive on in. So like I said, today we're boxing up and shipping our first set of snakes and they're going all the way over to New York to Gomez Pythons. They actually got a pair of snakes from us. This pair of snakes is real special to us and like I said, this is our first time shipping. So let's go over to Mrs. Small Town and watch her box up some snakes. All right, me and Mrs. Small Town is gonna do this process together. That way we have alignment and consistency on no matter who ships our snakes. Right, Mrs. Small Town? Yep. Yeah. All right. So let's, first of all, we need to build the box. Big shout out to James at Reptile Gems for his video on how to ship snakes and also Alyssa from Full Throttle Reptiles. Watch both of your videos this morning just as a recap. And uh, Reptile Gems uses this same style tape that we use. So what did I learn? I learned not to over wet it because it'll get everywhere. Okay, so now we build the box. So here is a bottom please. Bottom. Bottom. And these kind of go in like a puzzle. Okay. Around in a circle. Yeah. Kind of like shingles. Okay, well, so that's gonna be a snake side. So let me show the crowd here. So for anyone that hasn't built a box, they kind of go in staggered like a shingling system. And you leave a gap right here for the next piece to go in. For further details, go see Reptile Gems episode. Okay, we gotta attach the pack to this. Oh, all right. Packing tape. Look at, man, they designed these things perfect. So we, uh, because of the heat on our end, we chose to ship with the Phase 22 Cryo Packs, which are available at all shipping supplies where you would buy any of these boxes. And put that piece in. Okay, so if you see in here, we're using uh, colored shredded paper, just like Reptile Jim suggested. We bulk ordered it from Uline. Um, I did not do the paper shredder version, but anyways, you can see over here, this is our phase 22 cryo pack and our snakes will be packed on the opposite side of that. So these snakes were fed uh, last Thursday and today is Tuesday. All right, so we have uh, punched two holes on this side, one long side and two holes on the other side to give them some airflow for travel. Now we will bag up the snakes, but you guys need to jump over to Gomez Python's YouTube channel, subscribe, like it and all that stuff, and uh, you'll see what he actually bought and he'll do the unboxing on his video. So I'm not gonna tell you what I'm shipping over there. So this is how we chose to uh, ship our snakes, similar to how we do our t-shirts with the sticker tag and the business card tag. Adds a little professional touch. Snake ID will be on the bottom, which you're not allowed to see. Take a look at it or get them off. Yeah, okay, kind of nest them down in there, make sure they're secure, and then we're gonna have to fill around them. Yep, they look great. Just like that. Yeah, and fill around. So as a part of our shipping thing, you'll get uh, all your information on your particular ball python, care sheets, 
We have uh, some more professional fancy ones coming, but they did not get here in time for this first shipment. So this is what it looks like. Snakes are all snuggled in their little beds, packed around with the colored crinkled shredded paper. Remember, snakes on one side, phase 22 on the other side. You don't want your snakes coming in direct contact with any heating or cooling. And we use the 12 by nine by six size box because that is what's recommended if you're gonna do any kind of heating or cooling. So, I know not every snake I've received, they have followed those guidelines, but now that I'm shipping, I know what the guidelines are. So we will follow those guidelines. Okay, here's all your information, Sal, right there. We need to... You don't want to go on the top frame? No, this has to be on. So this is part of the Lacey Act. And uh, they want you to put one of these in on top of any other stuff in here. So just in case your box gets damaged and they need to open it to find out what's in it, it's right on top, ball python, scientific name, how many is in there. So that is that. right here and fold it over these edges right here so you cut it you know so you're gonna just need to go right here and fold over right here how we packaged and shipped our snake. You know, it's got all the appropriate labels, Lacey Act labels on the sides, got two holes on each of the long sides, shipping label up top, Small Town Exotics uh, branding packing tape on the sides, you know. Thank you, Sticker Mule. A big shout out to James from Reptile Gems, Alyssa from Full Throttle Reptiles. Thank you for your videos. They, they helped me out greatly. So that wraps up this episode. That was our first time shipping snakes. So let me know if I did anything wrong or if you would have done anything different. Big shout out to Gomez Pythons. Make sure you jump over to their channel. Hit the subscribe button and the bell and all the likes and all that stuff. We look forward to doing plenty of business with you guys in the future. Sal is a great guy. So make sure you follow him on Instagram and everything too. And until next time guys, rock on. Big shout out to James from Reptile Gems, Alyssa from Full Throttle Reptiles. Thank you for your videos. They they helped me out greatly and uh, our packaging of, of attempts, our packaging effort, our packaging job. Um,